So. <laughs> ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Hmm. <laughs> it's nine o'clock at night. Um, December 3rd. I really wanted to do Vlogmas this year. And I am. I'm just going to start on December 3rd. And, uh... <laughs> it's going to be really hard to get anything out. Because, um... Every computer I have has to have problems. And also... I keep forgetting and also I don't know where my channel's gonna go because of this stupid new thing with the whatever ugh, the thing they're doing where they're making you choose oh my gosh I look so weird they're making you choose like you have to you know you know the thing everybody knows the thing you have to now um Make your channel either, like, labeled as made for kids or not made for kids. And, um, if you label it the wrong way, they can find you a cr What am I talking about? Find? Fine. You a crap ton of money. Um, the, the, the kind of money that we don't have. Like, I don't want to, like, I don't think that that's going to happen, but, like, it's a little scary. Like... I, if, if they, if I say my channel's not made for kids, and YouTube says, oh, actually, we think it is, they can just find me a bunch of money, and I'm a 16-year-old who doesn't have money, and my parents don't have much more money than me, to be honest, I'm not gonna disclose how much, but, like, uh, I'm not living, you know, I'm not in a mansion in L.A. I only have a thousand subscribers that don't even watch my videos. I don't, I'm not monetized on this channel. I don't know now, now, and now I don't know. I think I might just label my channel as for kids because there's kids in it. But it's not like, 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 uh, when I'm not talking, like, to kids, like, right now, like, I'm not, I don't even know who's watching this, but, like, I checked my analytics, and I guess for the couple people that do watch it, it says, like, my biggest age demographic is 18 to 24-year-olds. That's not kids. Also, I don't want to make videos for kids. Like, I'm not talking to you like you're a child. I'm talking to the whoever's watching this as if you, oh my gosh, I look really weird. That's, like, such bad lighting. Anyway, who cares the crap? I'm talking to you as if... Oh my gosh, I have to move. It's just bothering the heck out of me. Um, I'm talking to you as if you are an adult. That's slightly better, but I look like a drug addict. Um. And, but I think I might just label my videos as for kids. Because... I guess that if kids are in a video, it must mean it's for kids. Stupid as heck. Because, like I said, like, I'm not, like, the, the content of my vlogs are not, like, for kids. I'm not talking to you like easy for your kid. But I choose to show my little sister in the vlogs. And it's kind of hard to not. Also, it'd be kind of boring without her in it. And also, even though I actually, if you haven't noticed, I've been trying to have her in the videos not as much. Not predominantly starring her in the videos. But also, my sister and my cousins are 12 and 13. They're kids. They're in my videos a lot. Because um, I hang out with them a lot. And um, they're really entertaining. And imagine the videos without them, it would be super boring. And, um, I'm not exploiting them. They're 12 and 13. I started my channel on my own accord when I was 12. Nobody put a camera on my face. I chose to do that. 
Like, I'm not putting a camera in their face. It, it like, I, I, I just whip out my camera. My style of vlogging lately has been to whip out a camera when something interesting is happening or when I have something to say, um, and I film it, and, um, sometimes I upload it, uh, just on my social media, and then sometimes I upload my, I put my videos together and upload them on YouTube, um, because that's what I like doing, and honestly, I was getting pretty optimistic about it, um, and I was, because I, I now have a thousand subscribers, I was like, I, I, I thought that the only thing holding me back from getting monetized was not having a thousand subscribers, so I was like, oh yeah, I have a thousand subscribers, now I can get my channel monetized and I can make a little extra cash because my only source of income right now as a 16-year-old um, homeschooler is um, babysitting money and um, my main babysitting job that I make a decent amount of money from is only in the summer right now because the girls, um, the kids I was watching used to go, um, used to be homeschooled, so I used to watch them a lot, but now they go to school, so now I only watch them in the summer. Also, um, and, and so I had, like, some little odd jobs, um, like, for my church and stuff, but it wasn't, like, the main, like, church babysitting, it was, like, a separate, uh, I won't go into that, but I, it did get paid for it. Not much, being, um, it might be between, it was between me and my friend Kylie, um, um, we didn't get that much money at all, but it was, like, a little something-something, um, but, um, now I'm just, uh, spending all my money on Christmas presents, um, which is all, what I saved my money up, well, I saved all my money up for driver's ed, but I already took driver's ed, um, but, I, I, now, then I saved up money for, like, this year I just have been saving up money for Christmas presents, um, I got most of them, but now I'm just kind of have, like, no money. I kind of have just, like, some of my b bank account. I know it's not absolutely necessary for a 16-year-old girl to have, girl, to have her own spending money, but, um, you know, I'm 16, I want my own spending money, I want a job, I want, like, to save up for important things. I'm not, like, looking to go to college, really, then. Uh, or anything, but, um, you know, you know, like, I'm not, you know, <laughs> uh, but it was just being, ha I know I probably wouldn't get much money at all from YouTube, <sighs> because I don't have a big audience at all, I have barely an audience at all, um, the majority of my video views come from myself watching my videos over again, because I actually like it watching me videos over again, because, like, it's just, it sounds egotistical, but, like, I think I'm good at, at some of the videos, um, I, I mean, I think I'm good at editing, I think I'm good at, but, uh, and also, I just, like, you know, I like re-watching those memories, it's like looking back at pictures, um, I think what I am gonna do is I'm gonna start also uploading my videos on Facebook, because also then some of my family members who like watching my videos who don't really know how to use YouTube can um, watch them on Facebook. And I do do, do kind of do them, like, like, like if, if at least family and friends sees my videos, then, um, I, if at least they're seeing that, I'll, I'll be happy. But I just, you know, I really like the idea of, um, I'm not quitting YouTube, but this is getting at... That's not what this is getting at, but, um, I really just, you know, I like the idea of having a wider audience, and I guess I'll just have to play this by ear and see where this thing is, this children's online, whatever protection thing is act is called, I don't remember what it's called, I'll just have to play it by ear and see how that goes, but I think what I'm gonna start doing is uploading some or all of my videos, my recent videos, like, when I make new ones, to YouTube <sighs> I mean Facebook <laughs> uh the hurry on YouTube um as well as YouTube 
Facebook as well as YouTube. Um, yeah. I'm just going to have to start doing that. Um, and just, I'm just going to upload on the Facebook as well as YouTube. And if the YouTube thing flops, I'll just keep uploading on the Facebook, but I really just, I'm going to be really, like, devastated if, if, if it don't, if it doesn't work out. Like, I don't know, I just feel like it's in my blood. Like, I feel like I just... I have the right personality right, right now. I'm not being very YouTube bubbly, but like, I'm really comfortable in front of a camera. I like doing, I like editing my own stuff, and like, I don't know. I just like doing it, and I'm gonna be really. It's just gonna feel like a loss if it doesn't work out, or if I get find a bunch of money. I don't remember exactly how much money it was, but um. Hopefully I'm getting my information read on that, and if I'm not, I don't, uh, I might not be getting my information read on that, but I'm pretty sure that it's like, you gotta find a ton of money. Um, but like, yeah, I think I'm just gonna label my channel as for kids because there's kids, children presented in the video, but like I said, I'm a four year old. And a 13 year old should be put on different levels. Like, I know, sadly, that the reason they're doing this is because there's creeps out there. But. Oh my gosh, I like don't even know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking out loud. I'm just like. I'm trying to process it all in my head. Maybe it's not as big of a deal as I'm making it seem, but, like, when you're under 18 and you're running a channel, like, what does that mean for you? Like, what about those 12-year-olds that are uploading videos all by themselves? And, like, out of their own accord. I'm not a family vlogger, like, shoving cameras in my... I, I sometimes, like... I might say to, like, my little sister, like, I want to do this, want to do the, the, the Lulu show, want to do, but, um, actually, I haven't done that that much lately, and she, like, comes up to me, because she's, you know, a little impressionable kid, she sees stuff, by example, she comes up to me, and she's like, I want to vlog, and actually, she's made some really cute stuff lately. Like, I've, like, given her the camera, and she's, she's four now, not a little baby. She can, like, hold it all by herself, and she talks. And I haven't really, like, she did this cute little, like, room tour, where she, like, she was like, here's my bed, and here's the posters and the walls, little four-year-old. Um, and I didn't post that on anything, and then she did a little thing, and this, I let her take her camera and this, it, take the, uh, my phone in the store, and she was recording it. She was like... There's the vacuum section, and there's the craft section. I'm um, gonna didn't upload any of it because I'm like, I don't know what to do. Like, I, I feel weird about uploading stuff with her in it lately, but, you know, just feels like something's missing when I don't. Although, like, <laughs> uh, you know, I ha like, I have to admit, I'm pretty entertaining all by myself. Oh. Uh, but, like, yeah. Basically, I sound like a broken record, but, like. I'm, I don't want, I, like, I would be so mad. It'd be one thing if I did YouTube for a couple years and I got paid for a couple years and I was like, well... It's run its course. I've had a decent audience. I got some money from it. You know. Oh well. Time to move on to bigger and better things. But like. I didn't even get started. Like yeah. I've been on here for five years. But I only just recently got a thousand subscribers. 
And guess what? I'm not even getting any engagement because all because YouTube's been disabling all my comments. So if the comments on this video are disabled, which they probably aren't be won't be because I think I'm just this is just gonna be a video of just me. But YouTube has been disabling the comments on like a lot of my recent videos, um, because there's kids featured in the videos. So I don't know what people think of my videos. I don't know if people's watching them or not. Uh I mean, I know I can see the views and stuff, but, like, you know, I like when you can see comments. The only videos, like, that I've seen comments coming through are my old Disney videos. My old Jesse videos. And I don't give a crap about my Jesse videos. I literally don't. I literally, like, if it wasn't for, honestly, I don't even make any, like, oh, gosh. Like, I would probably, if I made, if I made money on my channel, if my channel is monetized, I probably would just be making money from those videos. Like, because the views I get on those videos, like, compared to the views, it's like, I'll upload a video about, oh, I, I don't upload these anymore, but, like, I'll upload, I uploaded a video about, like, about something about Jesse, and it gets, um, like, literally, like, 10,000 views, and my most recent vlog is, like, two views. Like, okay, so if I wanted to make a completely successful channel, I would just delete all my vlogs, um, and, uh, I would just delete all my vlogs, make my channel labeled as for kids, and, uh, have them all be about Disney Channel and Jesse and Disney actors and stuff I don't really care about anymore because I grew up and I got out of that stage and I'm nope, not passionate about making videos about that anymore, especially lazy videos like I made that were just compilations. I didn't even put that much work in... Okay, but like really what I like doing is vlogging and stuff like that and sketches, um, but that stuff's just not popular, I guess. I mean, vlogging was popular, but I guess just not for me, like just not popular for me. <sighs> Literally, so if I, that's what I would do if I actually just was like... I'm gonna get money, I would just like apply for monetization and just make my channel a Disney channel. <laughs> Disney channel 2, <laughs> like, where we just talk about the Disney channel. And we don't actually know, I would just make it a Disney compilation channel. If I really just care about money, and then, and then actually those probably wouldn't get money now that I think about it because it's copyrighted material. But if I just had every title make that much money, oh I'd be making so much money off of it. And the amount of comments I get on those videos. Every day, notifications about those videos. They're either comments that don't make any sense. Like that are from five-year-olds. Who watch, more realistically, like eight-year-olds who watch the Disney Channel. And they're like, I love Disney. I love, like, like, like love, love this. Why are their voices deep? Are you related to Cameron boys? Or people actually like recently like making comments like rest in peace camera voice which is fine but then I did get somebody like making a comment on that one sketch I made um like this is disrespectful camera voice died I'm like I made this before do you check dates uh anyway uh, not to go on a tangent about that but like I think I'm just going to upload this video all by itself with no intro or anything, but, like, that's my situation lately. I've just been getting kind of lazy about my, ch my about my videos lately. Because I'm like, well, it might not work out anyway. So I might as well just be lazy about it. And I know that's a terrible attitude to have. But I kind of can't help that attitude. And like I said, I think I'm just going to... Keep doing what I'm doing and try to make stuff a little bit better. Try to make content a little bit better and also upload them to Facebook. <sighs> and maybe in the future, when my sister and cousins are older and not minors, maybe years in the future, I can move on to a bigger and better platform or I can go back to YouTube. I'm at, talking like I'm quitting YouTube. I'm not planning on quitting YouTube. But I, I, I'm just talking about like if it, every if if all else fails, um, yeah, I can just or go back to YouTube and um, yeah, basically yeah, 
wish me luck.